Hello everyone, uh, Crystal Fisher here. It's Welcome here. to Poltergex. Not Poltergeist, Poltergex. Not Zeitgeist, that movie that has a bunch of rumours you know, conveyed as if it's a fact. Um, still entertaining. Anyway, the point is, today we're here in Poltergex, and we're going to be doing... This is going to be a nightmare, but you saw so I'm just going to do it the speed running way. The way that I feel is the most necessary, which is just get them all, and then get so the bonus ones later on. Okay, so for now, we're just going to... Actually, actually, maybe I will get the hidden remote... Um, Maybe I will get the hidden remote, like, straight up, um, as well. But, basically, the f this level is one of people's most hated levels. Like, no one speed runs this level because they really, really don't want to. Do you know what I mean? Like, it's one of those just really kind of hated, um, really difficult as well. Like, I would actually consider it difficult. You know, like, just, just for the mere fact that, like, there's just a lot of... A lot of shit that happens, a lot of, like, enemies that can kill you. Everything can hurt you. You know, even more so than Pangea 90210. Like, it's just, it's really difficult. And especially getting all three. Um, what can we do? Go down here. Get that. We've got this thing now. Oh, this is the first time we see this, isn't it? It is the, um, the fabled, um... Uh, her, um, ice power, which is kind, it's kind of similar to the fire one, you know, in the sense that you can kind of run faster and all that stuff, but other than that, it's pretty useless, it gives you a bit of, big, bigger jump, and I guess immunity, so no, it isn't useless, it's probably the most effective thing ever, really, but, you know, that's just what I think. Now, what we unlock here is something in which we can go back here, jump across, whoa... Anything in there? No, you know, I'm not I'm not going to go for that other one. And then, what we can do now is push that in all the way, and look at that. We unlock the secret remote. So, so far, so good. The inevitable fail will happen when we have to 100% this, because they're just... Oh my god, having to go around the whole level? Like, give me a break. Like, I'm just going to kill myself a couple times, actually. That's seriously all I can be bothered doing. Yeah, I hate these little bits here. you got to be really patient and stuff, so... In speedrunning, th this sort of concept is uh, not your friend. Now, there we go. Make it across. But, yeah, I do know where... I, I finally did learn where all of the um, all of the blood callers were. Um, I'll tell you what I'm going to do. Ready? I'm going to do it speedrunning method again, just because I think it's a good idea. Ready? So, what you can do... Jump on that. Oh, the, the clock returns. Hit that. Oh, I should have hit it when I was about to go in the jump, but whatever. There we go. There's a one over there, but we don't need it. Instead, go down here. Look at this, look at this, look at this. Ready, boom. Boom. And already out here. Another one. Look at this, skip this. This, this whole bit here is just such an annoyance, but it's saved by the fact that that by the fact that we don't have to worry anymore because we've got, we've got the ice. So the ice stuff is really the saviour of this whole thing. Now is that seven? Yes, that's seven. That means we get the eighth. Go back down here. Look at this. I'm sure you guys are actually impressed with this. This is a Yoga Monyo's method in which he, he told me about. Um, you go down here. And then the eighth is right there. So, you know, this is probably the first Let's Play where it's almost done seamlessly now. I'm really kind of arrogantly going to, pro you know, proclaim my um, excellence at this challenge now. So, you know, thank you, thank you everyone. Now let's just get another life, just because it's fun. I need to supersize this bad boy. Yeah, shut up. 27 lives. We've actually been going back and forth from 27 <laughs> lives for quite some time, haven't we? Um, so yeah, pretty, pretty quick. Now, all we need to do is there's two more challenges. I'm going to do the easy one, and then I'm going to do the long one, and that's where I'm going to get them all. Oh, and we've unlocked another boss. Mecha Res. Mecha Resolution. So, this is how you do it. I'm pretty sure this is the method. Yeah, this is... No, this is, you're right, this is the method. Ready? So, you go across here. Go across there. Can you do the jump? Yes, you can make the jump. Sometimes you can't make the jump, and then you get upset that you can't make the jump. So, yeah, I forgot to mention that this is the third third and uh, not final um, not third and sorry what am I trying to say third and not final um, one of these levels you know like scary ones you know obviously obviously the developers just loved making these and look we return to this kind of morbid you know thing here I don't know what you want to call it but it's really creepy um, there's lights flickering it says cold ones on there that has to be a reference to um, um, 
What's his name? That's got to be a reference to ACDC. It's like that exact same font, you know? Now that's what I call getting some tail. Well, you're a funny guy, aren't you? And here we go. Now we're going to get them all. This is going to be difficult. So this is the third and final one. This is the longest method. Um, I still recommend it, doing it in speedruns cause, like, just because you have to. You know, with speedrunning this game, just a little tip is that, you know, you actually need to get almost every single um, red remote. So it's kind of merciless in that, in that uh, respect. So what three, one little quick like tip to ten. get a few is this gives you three. Look at that one on 15. There we go. Nice. And then probably should have got that one. These ones give you a couple. We're on 23, so we're doing okay. That, let's admire this. Look at that. It's amazing that I can actually do this level relatively quickly now, or quicker than usual. And, like, it's kind of, it's one of those levels that most people go, oh, fuck this. But I'm kind of in now, at least with the first two challenges, kind of, I sh I'm more with the opinion where, you know what? If you just kind of play it a little bit, you can actually do it a lot easier now. The employee of the month is clearly some... Um, Negro there, um, looks like a familiar face, but I don't know what. 300, it says 375 accidents this month. Always look out for Crystal Dynamics' uh, visual humour. Now those paintings there also seem to be saying something interesting. Okay, let's go down here, whoa, no, don't want to go down here, this bit has no bits of relevance, ever. Okay, ready? Three. Slip of the tongue, baby. Yes. Did he say slip of the tongue, baby? Because that's what I'm going to... I'm just going to assume he said that. Now, when you open these doors, they pretty much do nothing, but they just... Um, oh, that takes away the power, damn it. These doors have nothing in them except for a few rest in peace symbols. Um, rest rest in pee. Okay, ready? Go down here. Who forgot to pay the gravity bill? What? You're a fucking cooker, Gex. Cooker means like you're stoner. Okay, anyway. So, I, you know, um, yeah, so, you know what? My opinions have changed on this level, you know? Um, I think you're seeing now a new side of Poltergex, you know, by me playing it. You know, it's, it's not, as, not, as, not as hard as we all think, you know? It still is, I still call it challenging. You know, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna, um, make it look too easy. It's not easy. But it's just not as not as difficult once you kind of know what you're doing. I, I think the blood cooler one puts everyone off because it's like, what eight collectible things? You know, like that's ridiculous. You know, I think that's that's what that's what happens. Um, now this is the exit level, but I just want to check if there's anything. Yeah, we get that one. Get another three. Tail time. Now I don't want to collect that because I think I'll lose my I'll lose my I'll lose my thing. Now. I don't know if this is even the right way to go as well. Now, I, I think... Can you kill these guys again? I can't remember if you can kill them. You, can you kill them? Kill! Die! Nah, you know what? Fuck you. What did he say? Oh, now there's a little skip here. You can do this. Ready? Watch this. What? Hey, come on. Wait. Seriously, I don't know what you'd do without these... Collect these things here. They, they're really useful. Now we kill that guy. Kill, kill, kill. There you go. I used to think that the power of that, um, the ice thing, I read somewhere that it's meant to kill people in, like, one go, but that didn't kill anyone in one go, so... I am disappointed. Oh, oh, no. Actually, no. What we should do is... Go down here. Just because I... Even though it could be risky. Um... Oh, shit. Yeah, it's probably gonna be too risky, isn't it? We need, oh, I need to collect more, um... Oh, fuck it. Fuck off. I hate this section. Who... Who came up with this section? It's a fucking piece of shit. Yeah, because I wanted to get the Chucky guy, because that gives you six. It's pretty smart. And then, also, if you go up here, we'll get another one of these, uh... Invincibility. Um, I'm just going to call it Invincibility. Okay, there we go. 30. Are we on? Oh, because we're on... Oh, wait, no, I probably have enough now, don't I? I forgot that we, um... We have it. We probably have enough, so... That's all good. Okay, so that was probably a mistake, but whatever. Okay, ready? Let's just power through. Power through, like we always do. Step into the light except not really. Go up the normal way. <laughs> I love glitching this for you guys so you get to see kind of a different aspect of Gex, you know? There we go. Oh, imagine having, yeah, 100% of this in speedruns as well. Fuck off, I tell you, that would be an absolute shit. Just saying, okay. So now what we do is we unlock this little bit here. I'm pretty sure this is, you push these in and it will it will unlock, unlock the door. No, actually, I know that for a fact, but I, I don't know why. Okay, there we go. Push that in. What does that do? That should... Oh, it doesn't, it doesn't destroy them all yet. It doesn't destroy them all. Push a few more in. Push four more. Oh, we've lost our power. Let's get that. 
32, 33, 34. There we go. It's like a little chamber room area. Um, what's up there? Can you get up there? I don't know. I don't know. Oh, and the door's open. But what we should do, get three more. 36, 37, 38. I reckon we'll just scrape by. Um, oh, another area, another door. We can, which we can glitch up by doing this. There we go. I love doing that. It three never more, ceases to amaze set. me. The fun of... Oh, shit. 44. Sheesh, this is getting crazy now. 47. Here we go. 47. We're getting close. We're actually probably going to just make it to the end of the level. There's probably going to be like a few more. Whatever they are. There they are. There we go. 49. And we didn't have to kill a Chucky. So we probably didn't have to go the other way to get all that those other few ones. It was, I think it only gave us like three or four, so it was kind of a waste of time, but... Um, you know, oh, we've hit 30 lives. You know, this has been a very, very therapeutic level playing through this today. Like, no fails. It's just been just pure, pure ecstasy. Okay. Not ecstasy, because, you know, you know, I probably, I'm probably paying. Oh, this is a very nice room, too, though, but probably paying for it. I probably should, should be doing some more schoolwork, but I, I will. I will. I, I promise myself I will. Okay. I remember, don't, don't try to be too much of a smartass up here. You will fall off. And we're done. I know what you're thinking. It's tail time. Yep. You sound pretty stale at this point, Gex, but whatever. Not going to complain too much. In the next part... Um... Hmm. Oh, we unlock a new area. You know what? Uh... I'm going to go to Trouble in Uranus. Yep. Please tell me it's down in this area here. Is it? It wasn't, wasn't it? I'm a literal idiot, aren't I? I'm figurative, virtual... Confirmed idiot, I think. Yep, confirmed idiot. Alright, whoops, that was the dumbest thing I think I could have ever done. But we unlock a new level. I think I from like the I saw a U in it, so I'm gonna assume it said trouble in Uranus. But the question is where is it actually? Oh wait, seriously, where what What? Okay, you know what? Trouble in Uranus can wait. Instead, we're going to go to this level here. This old cave. It's old and it's this.